Hi everyone, in this video I'll show you how to import 3D models into Roblox. We'll go through everything step by step, from exporting the models to getting them to look right in Roblox Studio. As an example, I'll use the Sweet Land Pack. You'll find the link to it in the video description. By the way, in our packs we provide FBX files that you can import directly into Roblox without using Blender. So if you're using those, you can skip this part of the video and go straight to the import section, but we'll still take a quick look at how to prepare models in Blender. Before we start, let's prepare the models in Blender. Make sure each model has only one material and one texture. If a model has multiple materials, remove the extra ones and leave just one. Otherwise, the textures might display incorrectly in Roblox. Next, create separate folder, for example, call it models, and move all your textures there. Then, in Blender's shader editor, connect the correct textures from that folder to each material. This way, when you import your models into Roblox, the textures will apply automatically. Now select the objects you want to export. Go to File, Export, FBX. In the Export settings, check Selected Objects, so that only the chosen models get exported. We'll use the FBX format, but you can also export as OBJ if you prefer. FBX automatically applies textures if they are located near the model, but the scale in Roblox might be off, that's easy to fix manually. OBJ keeps the correct scale, but it merges all objects into one, which isn't always convenient. After exporting open Roblox Studio and create a new project, for example, using the baseplate template. Before you start working, save your project by clicking Save to Roblox and fill in the required details. Now let's move on to importing models. First method, using Asset Manager. In the bottom left corner, open Asset Manager, go to the Images tab and click Bulk Import. Select your texture files, set up the import options and click apply all. After the check, your textures will appear in the images folder. Then, in the same way, import the models you exported from Blender. If there are many models, you might need to wait for the verification process. If some texture didn't connect automatically, open the model settings. Find the Texture Content field, click Add Image and choose the right texture manually. Second method, using Import 3D. Click Import 3D, choose the model and place it in the scene. Since I imported an FBX file, the objects appeared way too large, so I'll reduce the scale by 100 times. If all the objects ended up inside one parent container, just drag them up in the hierarchy and delete the empty one. This method is handy if you want to place all your models directly in the scene right away. After adding the assets to Asset Manager and importing them into the scene, I can now build a small demo location to show how they work. In the next videos, I'll show you how to import animated characters into Roblox and how to build complete environments. Thanks for watching.